The electrical potential sensor is a sensor technology which has been invented and developed at the University of Sussex and it can be thought of as essentially um, a voltmeter which is capable of measuring potentials without actually making physical contact with the source that's generating them. One application we've highlighted is a forensic one. Currently there is a problem uh, in forensic science that it's very difficult to establish exactly when a fingerprint was deposited, so in other words to be able to date it or timestamp it. So we're able to image not the conventional fingerprint that you will see used, but the electrical charge that is left behind when you contact a plastic surface. And we can do this with enough resolution so that we can actually identify the person and also give an indication of when that fingerprint was placed there. It's such a new application that we, we, we went and discussed this with um, Sussex Police Fingerprint Bureau and so they're really interested in this technology so we're looking at how we can turn it into a product that they can actually use in their laboratories. The wonderful thing about the technology that I work with is it's entirely unique and there's nothing like it out there. One of the really nice things about working in this group is the amount of contact that I have with my supervisor. So Professor Prance is my main supervisor but there's also the other professors in the group and we're constantly working together and coming up with new ideas together and interacting all the time and, and that is really valuable. We have a very open structure in our research group and we encourage postgraduate students to develop their own ideas as much as possible. I work very closely with Philip, I have done all the way through his PhD and he has developed some very nice ideas which have led to some extremely interesting interactions and during that time he's also had the opportunity to interact with people from industry who are interested in the applications that have arisen directly from his work. The work that we've developed on fingerprinting which has obvious applications to forensic science are very much a direct result of work that Philip has done. He's now making the transition to becoming a postdoctoral research assistant and part of the support that we give him during that process is helping him to develop his own ideas and apply for funding so that he can start his own career. So now that I'm nearing the end of my PhD I'm going to continue investigating this technology. Because we have such good industrial partnerships um, I've actually received funding directly from Plessy Semiconductors to continue investigating this technology and finding new applications and further developing the ones we've already discovered. I think Sussex has been an excellent place particularly for this project because it has a very broad generic base which cuts across many disciplines and I think the Sussex uh, tradition and history of interdisciplinary research has certainly been uh, an advantage to us.